Oh my goodness. Okay. <clears throat> uh, Zylo. 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 Yeah. Yeah. Oh, what, where are Come on you? In. Oh. oh. Okay. 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 <clears throat> I've gone through every single book possible that I have in my possession. Oh. Yeah. What'd you find? Nothing. Oh, that's inconvenient. Well, I did try a few things, you know, I didn't want to be helpless, so I tried sending an iris message, um, you know, at the at the shore in the water. That didn't work. No one answered. I, I mean, I didn't have a drachma, I just had, like, a nickel, but I thought maybe it would work the same. Oh, okay. Yeah, that that's definitely not going to work the same. Okay, well, no one answered anyways. And then I tried the whole, like, laying on my bed, staring into my ceiling, yelling at my mom like I'm in an existential crisis, and that didn't work either. Yeah, I tried the yelling thing too. It didn't quite work for me either. Yeah, so maybe the line is busy or something? Well, I suppose Aphrodite's line would be pretty busy. What hmm. are you trying to say? Nothing. Nothing. Um, she's just very important goddess. Mm -hmm. I'm sure that is what you were trying to say. Well, the last thing I can think of is I haven't really been through every single book at the mansion um but i have well, yeah been... there's quite a few books at the mansion well, yeah but like all i do is read but i have been through like basically all of brian's journals by now and i don't think there's anything in there that's gonna help us i think that we would be better off going and getting more resources like more books at the mansion well yes that's exactly what i'm saying and you need my help with that Four eyes are better than two, don't you think? You you want me to look through all these books to help you fix a curse that you may or may not have? No, 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 no. I, I, I can help. Sure. Okay, hey, perfect. Just... Yeah, why not? It's just what? Nothing. There's just wait, a lot. But... Wait, wait. Do, do you not know how to read? Of course I know how to read. I'm just saying, I mean, Ivy doesn't know how to read. I can teach another person to read. I don't mind. I know how to read quite well, thanks. Uh huh. Why do people occasionally assume I don't know how to read? Okay, okay. How many fingers am I holding up? Uh, zero. Yeah, I, I guess that wouldn't be a good test on if you know how to read or not, huh? No, that's not reading at all. That's counting. Okay, yeah, that's true. Well, anyways, I feel like we're not going to find anything here. Like, I've been through all the books, like, even over there, like, at the little school that's set up in camp. There's nothing. All right. Well, head to the mansion, see if we can find what we're looking for. Okay. Might be, uh... still be a stretch to find, I don't know, any of this, though. Well, I mean, if we're going to get to the bottom of this, we have to exhaust all of our options, don't you think? Yeah, sure. Let's do it. All right, let's go. Do you know the way? Yeah. Probably know it better than I do. Fair enough. Just go the quick way. Um, I'm not really a horse girl. Well, Shadow's not really a horse. Okay, it's an fine. undead magical Pegasus now. Whatever you say. Find huh. anything over there? No, not quite. At least, well, but there's a lot. That's just not any specific answers we're looking for. Yeah, uh, most of these books don't even have titles on the spines. Like, I feel like I'm gonna have to sift through every single one, every single page. Yeah, I guess so. But there's got to be like some sort of magic that can do this, right? Um, well. I'm still having a hard time with my magic. I mean, I think huh? I've kind of got, like, the charm speak thing down a little bit, but other than that, not really anything. Uh. Silo? Huh? Oh my gosh! Uh... Silo, there's a ghost! There's a ghost! This place is haunted! What's going on? Um, oh, this is gonna be very awkward. Silo, oh, it's you! Uh, hey! <laughs> How's yeah. it going? That's Pretty... Who I think it is. Are you a ghost? It's me, Brian. And I've ever died. And you're 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 really Oh you you're okay, so you're actually there. And what There's happened? No way. I came back to life. Surprise! You're supposed <laughs> to be in Elysium right now. 
And I was in Elysium. A <laughs> funny thing that was. Huh. Well, that's interesting. It's a long story, but I guess I can... And I'm not sure how to feel about it, but welcome back. Thanks. It's kind of good to be back. And I have kids now. Yeah. That's new. Yeah. yeah. They're really something. Yeah. Oh. Who's this? Is this a, your girlfriend? Uh, no. Um, uh... No, no, it's not. It's... Well, um, hmm, don't know how to say this. I'm Brinley. But yeah, this is Brinley. Brinley? Your sister. What? <gasps> you're, you're the, you're, you're my other sister? Is it really The kids you? mentioned you. How, it's hard to believe. How are it's, you? I mean, I've only seen you in, in pictures. <laughs> Are you really here right now? Yes, I'm really here. I did die. That's very true. I was brought back, though, by the kids and Kiran and Impu. So he finally got what he was working towards. They created a new soul crystal for me, and now I'm here. Can I hug you? Of course. The kids have mentioned you a lot so far. I don't know how long I've waited to meet you. I can't believe you're... Silo, you didn't know anything about uh, this? I mean, I didn't know it had happened. Uh, it just happened just a day ago, so... Pretty recently. Huh? I mean, I just can't believe this. I mean, I've only seen you in a couple pictures, and I've just learned about you through your journals and everything. Like... I can't believe you read my journals. Uh, she's she's a fan. <laughs> I mean, I'm not I'm not a fan. I'm apparently some of the kids are. I just that's why I said a fan. Didn't think I would ever meet you. I mean, is this what Impu is keeping from me? Do you think this is what Impu has been doing this whole time? He very much has been doing this for a long time. For... He's been doing this for five years now, trying to bring me back. Yep. I want to know everything. What happened? How are you here? Well, after I stopped the seductive rose with my soul crystal power, I lost my soul. Wait, you stopped seductive... Are you talking about back then or are you talking about now? He's talking about back then. Back okay. then. Obviously, it didn't stick. No, it didn't. Unfortunately. And then, well... Impu brought me to Elysium, and then later I saw Zyu Zylo lying there on the ground. Yeah, he helped me out a bit. And then ha, a bit afterwards, I was with Helios, my horse. And then all of a sudden, I awakened on the bridge where I, I died. Five years have passed by, it just doesn't impossible but now that I'm back it's mm. very complicated and weird but Wait, I'm so still getting adjusted to the idea that I'm back you're back but I mean isn't seductive rose also back I was told about that and yeah. funny thing is that we were connected apparently after the kids brought me back I guess the soul boundness with them transferred over to me. Mm -hmm. And then Morse came over here and unbounded me after he tried to kidnap Atlas. Well, All is, right. Is Atlas okay? Atlas is fine. Okay. Huh. But apparently the seductive rose has grown a lot more stronger than more than ever. Wait, wait, but he's not bound to the kids anymore? Not anymore. Wait, seductive he's not bound rose to you? was bound to the kids? No, but apparently, apparently the seductive rose, from what Morse told me, induced the mirror of armor. <sighs> You're not trying to say the mirror of Amaterasu, are you? Amaterasu is now inside of the seductive rose. Uh, who is Amaterasu? Who is this? 
Japanese goddess. Uh, th that? That means Set is out. Yeah, yeah, Set, the primordial Egyptian deity of chaos, stole a uh, ancient Japanese artifact and gave it to... <sighs> yep, okay, that makes sense. That it's makes sense. So he told me it was that... in the wrong hands, and it's in the wrong hands. But he's not bound anymore. I, I'm gonna go kill the seductive rose. See ya. Wait, 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 uh, wait, 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 come back. What? What? He's too powerful, even for anybody. Uh, beat him before I, I can beat him again. Just going alone. I'll take Moors along if I have to. He surely I wants a piece of them. I wouldn't suggest going at all. The last time someone fought seductive rose, I lost my brother that I didn't even know I had. Well, that's because it was my own fault for using the soul crystal, which I'm never gonna be using again. And can't we not do anything with Seductive Rose? Because if we hurt Seductive Rose, doesn't that hurt someone else? Or am I just having for this? That's what he's saying. It's fair game now, open season. Morse unbounded me, so now it's fair game to kill Seductive Rose once and for all. Well, you're not actually thinking about like going through with this, are you? I have to. But you, you can't. What if something happens? What if we all lose you again? To be fair, it's debatable whether he belongs here or not, so. Not debatable. You're back and you're staying back. Yes, but I don't know if the gods are going to very much like that. Yeah, as a uh, as one for speaks for the, you know, well-being of the underworld, I don't think they will at all. Just as more said as well. Yeah. Which I don't like, by the way. Yeah, I'm surprised that he's not dragging you down to the pits of Tartarus right now, but. Probably because I threaten him. Mm. And we made a deal. Okay. A, a deal? If, uh... Haven't you ever heard the saying, don't make a deal with the devil? True. Devil, per se. Might as well be. But I was the one that brought the seductive rose here. Mm. So... In all fairness, I need to be the one to come away somehow. Okay, well, don't make the mistake of doing it all by yourself again. We'll find a way. Exactly. Regardless, what are you even doing here at the manor? Um. Oh, um. I'll, try. Let, I'll let Zylo take this one. <laughs> uh, I need to talk to your mom. Our mom. Well, yeah. Aphrodite? Yeah, there's um, a situation <laughs> oh, where Aphrodite Mom? may or may not have cursed my entire family, and I'd like to fix that up. And plus, Brindley would like to meet her mother and maybe That's find true. out something about her own powers. I haven't talked to Mom in a very long time. Actually, the last time I talked to them, it was summer before... Everything else happened. Well, she's uh, spoken to talk? Brinley like somewhat before. Oh, well, that's true. I mean, mom did leave me here one time. And she just kind of spoke to me, told me to follow a feeling or something. And then I ended up here, which is how I learned about, you know, you and the kids and everyone. Mm -hmm. But since Apparently then, hasn't it's, said a word since. Yeah, it's kind of been radio silence. <laughs> The woman claims me, speaks to me once, and then uh, it's like she blocked me on all socials. That's that's our mom. She does that a lot. Even with me. Oh, I more wonder... reason for us to find a way to go talk to her personally. Exactly. Just we haven't found any possible way. Nope. Wait, mom never showed you how to communicate or even go to their place? What? What? That, that, that's a that's a thing. Well, I guess maybe only me and other our other siblings might know about this, but what the heck? Yeah, we can do that, and it starts with this manner. Oh, oh? maybe I didn't uh, figure out why I was supposed to come here then. Well, it's not Aphrodite's mansion because of anything actually the way we get to her house okay, perfect so uh, like how do, how do we get there do we have to like throw a drachma in a well or something 
That sounds absurd, but no. We actually have to go to the gazebo outside in the gardens and walk oh. in the water, and we will walk into her home. Now, now, how am I supposed to figure that out on my own? I kind of figured you already knew. Yeah. I don't know. Maybe if you accidentally like, go swimming in there one day, you'll... Oh, you think I swim? You think I'm trying to ruin my hair? I mean, it costs a lot to look this good. I don't know. People swim. No, no not to me. All right. We're basically able to go, but we'll have to hold Hilo Zylo's hand to enter. Sure. Okay, well, um, you can take one for the team with that one, right? Wow. I think that hasn't happened before, I right, Silo? Uh, <laughs> yeah, true, Wait, what I does suppose. that mean? Oh, well, <laughs> when I was under the influence of the Seductive Rose, we kind of went out on a date at the Wait, ball. What? Th this was not in the journals? Y yeah, yeah oh, that did happen. I never wrote it in. Yep. Apparently, wow. uh, so you go on a date with my brother, but then whenever you figure out who I'm the child of, you turn the other way and scream and run away. Yep. Men. I'm, I mean, anyways, uh, sh should we go see mom? Oh, uh, we should. All right, well, Not sure how she's going to take seeing me, though. I'm sure she's well, happy, we're going to find right? out. <laughs> we'll see. This the All place. Right. This is it. So we just walk in? It's that easy. Trust me. Okay. Um, does anyone want to count us down to the seconds before I ruin my perm? I, I think, think you're going to be okay. If you're a child of Aphrodite, I think your hair is going to be just fine. Uh, okay. <sighs> I might have messed up, though. Hmm. Shall we? Let's do it. Okay. Three, two, one, and walk. <gasps> oh. oh my goodness. Well, that wasn't too bad. Oh, oh. My hair seems to be intact. Perfect. Yeah. Are, are we on the clouds? Is this... Is this part of Olympus? Um... Oh. I actually don't know. Well, it definitely looks the place. like it might be Aphrodite's temple. Yeah. I can see where you get your uh, affinity towards giant mansions. What is that supposed to mean? It means your house is too big, Brian. Well, maybe if you had a bigger house, you wouldn't have too many issues. Maybe I don't need a bigger house to be happy. Uh, well, I just live well, in a cabin. Yeah, I used to live in a cave. It was fine. And look what happened to that cave. Yeah, but it had a hot tub. What, what happened to the yeah, cave? Uh, and just earthquake. Oh. Caves don't do so well. And, ooh. Hey, uh, close your eyes. Don't uh, look at my what, mom like uh, that. I'm sorry. It's yeah, don't look just, at our mom like that. The statue's just very big and very big. Yeah. But yeah, and? You don't need to make it weird, Zylo. It's, it's not weird. Just a pile of stone. Yeah, it's just a statue. Plus, mm -hmm. like, every statue and depiction of your mom is usually kind of naked or close to naked anyway. Okay, so... this is getting weird. Well, it's, it's just what it is. I'm sorry. We were just looking through books of Aphrodite for the past few hours. and Yeah, and Aphrodite there was a lot. probably likes to look at herself, so it's no wonder she'd have so many statues. She is yeah, perfect, after all. That's kind of the Ooh. idea. Yeah. So, it was just admiring the architecture. Mm -hmm. I'm sure you were. All right. I don't know where she's at, though. Yeah, this place she's just walking around. Unsurprisingly massive. I wonder where all the other people are. Yeah, where are all the dryads and stuff? I mean, that's at least what I me. read about. Oh. oh. This place is pretty cool. Wow, look Whoa. at this statue. That one's way more detailed. Jeez. Uh, that's like not me. a statue, you guys. Huh? What? what do you mean? Hi, Mom. Hello, my children. The statue's moving. Brian, protect me. It's Aphrodite, it's, Burnley. It's okay. That's Aphrodite. Wait, Mom? Yes, I'm Aphrodite, and welcome 
to my palace. Oh. Oh. Where's Grant? Yeah. It's really nice. Welcome back, my children. But I do have one question. Why did you bring him? Uh, oh. What? Oh. Um. Well. I'll, uh. uh you see, um... What's wrong with me? What? Yeah, what? What is exactly wrong with him? You're just trying to date my children. You tried to date my other child. Well... Are you going uh, after Brindley now as well? Uh, <laughs> Why does everyone keep saying Wait, that? Are no, you going to date my sister? Are, are you? No. Don't, don't get too close to me. It wouldn't be the first time. Are you trying to uh, date me? No. I would have done something... What? No, that's not why I'm here. I'm not here for any of your children. You know, it, it was one, it was two times, and that's it. Well, then, are you here to date me? No, no, I'm not oh. here to date you. I would never. What? I would never think of doing okay. that. Okay, this is getting a little out of hand. Wait, why not though? What do you mean, why not? She's a goddess. I'm sorry, what? Well, yeah, but she's beautiful. I mean, what's not to love? No, yeah, of, co of course she is. She's just, um, she, she's your mom. It would be weird, right? Um, it's. It's just yeah, she, I don't know how I'm sorry, about you're that. just you're um too big for me. Hey, don't bit. say that about my mom. What? I just met uh, oh. 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 Then is this better for you? Well, I <laughs> I, I suppose it um Well, is it Zylo? Uh, she, now do you yeah, want to date I, our mom, Zylo? Um I I don't feel like I'm comfortable answering that question. Um she's goddess aphrodite and uh, uh, did, uh didn't you guys want to want to say some words to her mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Uh, yeah that that is true yeah yeah this this is yeah mm -hmm. yeah how shall i feel about that but before we get into any discussion i must ask brian how are you alive well, Impu and the kids brought me back, but no thanks to you. I'm surprised you didn't help me while I was fighting the seductive Rose. Well, I actually did help you. Don't what? you remember? Oh, you didn't. Moonlight? Wait. What does she mean? That was you. Yes. You're the one that stopped that the storm. Me. Yes, of course. I. I wonder. I felt a connection that night. It was you. I didn't know. I was watching over you the whole time. I just thought the storm had passed randomly. Wow, so I mean, she every really time you use your there. powers, it's like she's there to some extent at least. Yeah. Well that was you that helped me that night. Indeed. And I'm just so proud of you for sacrificing yourself for your friends. Really? Yes. And after everything I did at the camp? Of course. Well, they do say there's no greater love than a mother's love, right? That's true. Ah, uh, means a lot, Mom. Of course. Hmm. Well, Mom, they're... You know, there is some things that I wanted to talk to you about as well. What is it, Brindley? Well, you know, you haven't really talked to me since I showed up at Camp Oasis, and I've always felt like, you know, maybe there's something wrong with me. I haven't been able to unlock any of my powers like my other siblings have, and I just can't help but think that maybe something's going on. Why am I not able to unlock my powers like the rest? Well, I could answer that question, but I'm not sure if I should be able to help you right now. What? Why? What? I've come all, all this way. way. Although, I do suppose, since you just did, you did just say that you came all this way, the only way for you to unlock your true powers is through true love. True love? Like... Well, I mean, can't you just, you know, skip that part and just, you know, give Brinley their powers? I mean, you kind of owe us. Yeah, you do owe us. And 
I sure I might not have a boyfriend or a girlfriend or something. Yeah, I'm not gonna be able to help with the true love thing. Sorry. Nobody I, I, wants I, you to help us with the true. Lo Shh. This this is a talk between family. Okay. Okay. Sure. Maybe I haven't gotten married, like Brian has. And sure, maybe <laughs> I don't have a boyfriend or a girlfriend, but that doesn't mean that I'm not capable of true love. I mean, I came to Camp Oasis. I was ripped away from everything I knew. And I do love everyone there. I love all of my family and my friends. And I would do anything for them. The same that Brian's done for everybody. I mean, he inspires me. I would do exactly what he's done for any of you guys. I do? Of course. You're my big brother. You're going to make me cry. Don't cry, you're gonna mess up your beautiful complexion. That too. I am so out of place here. So Brinley's right. I would say that I'm capable of true love, just maybe not in the way that you know it generally. Sounds like love to me. Hmm. I suppose you're right. It wouldn't have to be true love in that case. In the way of romance, and but it could be in the way of what you just said about your friends and your family. Exactly. So I think that's worth something, don't you guys think? I agree. Sounds like it. Then if that's the case, Brinley, I do have a gift for you. You have a gift for me? You should probably stand back. What? Uh, okay. What's gonna happen? Whoa. Um. Um. I don't exactly see the gift, but I do feel a little diff. Here. Hey, uh. Why look at my shield. Why are you guys looking? Oh yeah, my you gosh. have. And you have. I have wings. Wow. You can fly like me now. Mom, thank you so much. You're welcome. You've proven that you can find true love in other things besides romance. And for that, I've granted you your wings. Thank you so much. I I, I don't even know what to say. I mean, I, I kind of look like you. Well, of yeah. course, you are my child, after all. You should be looking like me. That, uh, that's oh, you true. guys look identical. Well, not identical. I mean, I can never amount to the measure of her beauty, but... Yeah. Why are you ruining this beautiful family moment? Yeah, I, yeah, I, 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 mean, I can step out if you want. It's just I, I came here for a reason too. Oh. Oh right. Oh, <laughs> I forgot about that. That is true. Um. Okay, yeah. It's, well. Sorry to interrupt, but there's the whole situation about a curse that I need lifted. I guess uh, take the floor, Zylo. We'll be here if you need us. Yeah. Sure. So, so there's a curse that's been placed on my family, I suppose, and I'd really like it if you can remove it. Um, what kind of curse are you speaking of? Some sort of love curse you placed on my mom, where you cannot find true love, but, you know, get close a lot or something. I don't know the full details of it. I'm not the one who placed the curse, or had the curse placed on me. Oh. But I'd just like it gone. I'd like it removed. Oh, no, I remember the curse now. I remember now. Yeah? I completely resent your mother. I dislike her. I hate her. That... And that's why she has the curse. And she deserves the curse. Uh, I don't know if she does. That was quite a long time ago. I don't know what... I, I know you two fought. I know you two didn't get along. But can't we just look past that now? I don't I mean, know. Look, I don't want the curse on me. And look, I'm friends with, you know, your children. Uh, I mean, this is true. I wouldn't say that... I mean, Mother, I would never go against you, obviously. We, we would never. But... Zylo's done a lot for me, though. He was yeah. there when I needed him the most, and... He's a good friend. Even though he smells sometimes when goes to the underworld but, but that's besides the point he's a good guy and he helped the know, camp a lot and he did help me whenever i first came to camp too I, he did kind of 
nursed me back to health, made sure I was okay, and gave me a place to stay. Hmm. You do no. make very fair points. He doesn't deserve the curse anymore, Mom. Perhaps I, I am holding a grudge against your family for this long. Yeah, I mean, honestly, I don't think my mom deserves it. She's sitting alone in a house for years, and that, I don't know. I don't, I don't think you would wish that on anyone. Or my case, where literally every evil woman I find just, I don't know. There's, it's a lot. And I just want it to end. I suppose you're right. You do make very fair points. And like I said before, I've been holding this grudge for a very long time. You know what? Fine. I'll lift the curse. Really? Yes. Oh, perfect. That's great. Thanks, Mom. But you do owe me a little favor because of it. Oh, oh. What kind of favor? The only way to lift the curse is through a kiss. I'm sorry, what? A kiss? Yes. Like a kiss on the hand or a kiss on, on the, the cheek. cheek? Oh no, a full kiss on the lips. You um, want me to kiss I'm you? I'm sorry, what? Can't, can't you just do your wand waving and shoot a heart at me like you did with her? Unfortunately, I can't. That's the only way the curse will break. Is that how you do the curses? You just kiss. You didn't kiss my mom, did you? For the curse? So, never mind. I don't want to know about that. Is is this really necessary? Yes. I, um, okay. Wait. Okay. Sure. You, you, he's just gonna kiss our mom. We're gonna let I gotta. Uh. No. 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 You can't kiss our mom. You you cannot kiss our mom. Kissing our mom is off limits. What are you gonna do next? Kiss me. He cannot kiss her mom. Brian, you're really going to let this happen. Mom. Well, if you oh, don't want him to kiss her mom, then you have to do something. No, well, you I don't make do it anything. happen. I mean, I you're the older sibling. Death, you're the like, one that has to do something about it. You're the youngest sibling. Well, what is that? We don't know that for a fact. I, I just came back to life, so I think I should get like a free to go yes, card. Yes, so you've taken like a five year long break. It's your turn to do something. Well, I didn't choose. Well, technically I did because I used the soul crystal, but that's exactly. besides the point. You made your bed, you lie in it. You go stop him from kissing no, our mom. No, you go stop him. No, you go stop him. Oh, you. No, you. Is this our first fight? No. Yeah, this is our first fight and you're going to do something about it. Go no, be the you're bigger gonna person. Do something. Will you be the smallest person? What? You're acting like the smallest person right now. Do you you want me to be the smallest person? Well, I'll be the bigger person, and I'll I'll push you over there to go do it. Wait, no, you can't. You go over there. No, you go over there. No, you go over there. So, do you think we have to like call him dad now? Um, I mean, are they like dating? I mean, technically, if they start dating, then he would be our dad i mean the kids already call him grandpa already so it would make sense you know i guess i mean i'm more of like a papa type of person pa oh i mean i already have a dad but i guess it's not that bad having two of them well it wouldn't be that bad maybe you know if we died he could just take us out again I don't want to talk about this anymore. It's been a rough day. Do you think he kisses weird with mom? Well, do you think he's doing more than kissing with mom? He's been up there for a while. I think I'm going to be sick. Me too, when I'm too pretty to puke. <sighs> All right. Time to go. Hey, Dad. Papa, what? what took so long? Uh, could, could you not call me that? Huh? So, how was kissing our, our mom? Would you like me to describe it to you? In extreme so, detail. What, what, no. No, thanks. Uh, I, I, I think we should just go now. We're, we're going home. So, does this <sighs> mean that we get a gel out of free card in the underworld if we die? What, no. What? But, Dad, that's not fair. I'm not your dad. I mean, the kids call you grandpa. We think it. I think it's a. We'll just might as well make it official. I. Yep. Why? Why am I? 
always the dad. Dad, where are you going? I'm go going back. Uh, dad, uh, we can talk can't... about the wedding. It could be at my place again. Can't just I'm not, I'm not marrying your mom. I think he's in denial. Are you a gigolo? What's a gigolo? What does that even mean? Don't tell her. When a guy gets with a lot of girls. Wait, Dad, remember you have to go in there with us? Do you really want me to hold your hands right now after, you know? Please, Dad. Uh, okay. Maybe you Just can hold never going to let this go, by the way. Wait till I tell everybody. No, don't, don't tell everybody. Anyways, let's go. <clears throat> So small, watch the clock ticking off the wall. But tonight I'm letting go. Spend my coin for sure.